If you had the ability to do what he did, you do it. If you could just send random goons. If you're Bowser, you're having minions that you know can't fuck with Mario. But you're sending them. You throwing Goompas at the door. Blade is in the corner. Just chill. This nigga different. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? You about to kiss him? That's what you about to do. You about to, you about to kiss that nigga? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy TSO Sage, and I'm back with another video. Man, I said I'm back with another video. Hey, man, today, bro, Slade, a true menace to society. One of these days, one of these YouTube motherfuckers is gonna get pissed, ain't they? Yo, who is this Durag boy? Why is he still in my intro? I'm not gonna lie, I'll fly out and beat his ass. I still keep doing them shits, nigga. Sorry, nah, but every for for the speds out there, everybody who's intro, I steal that. that, that means i like fuck with them duh anyway slade menace of society i ain't gonna lie slade's one of my favorite characters ever now here's the thing about teen titans and i'll be open and honest about it and people say this about danny phantom a lot of this shit's gonna be like oh fuck that did happen to me i truly forgot a lot of shit in teen titans I'm just gonna be honest i remember the characters i remember certain moments but a lot of shit in teen titans poof but then when I see it again, I'm like, oh, yeah. So a lot of the shit you're going to you, like, it's going to act. You go, you think I've never seen Teen Titans? I promise you I've watched Teen Titans endless amounts of times. I just truly have shit memory. It's justified by other shows that uh, we've observed in the past before we got the no, no words to not watch those shows anymore. But yeah, I just have shit memory, bro. God, no. Ball hungry as a is this the Boondocks OST? Wake, so I'm about to gobble on this glit. GG's. Oh, sh it is finally time to return to the round table of Black Air Force activity because today we got a special one. Because the last oh, time shit. we had one like this, it was about a good year ago. But ladies oh, and fuck. gentlemen, stepping up to the plate. I haven't the seen the Omni Man show, whatever that show is called. I forgot it. I know about the boys, though. Still ain't seen that, but I know it. The most devious, vile Disgusting niggas that ever do this shit. Man, it's Slade a bad motherfucker. A cartoon character, but man, y'all are Slade a bad motherfucker. Bro drove Robin insane, literally. The master of the fade. So, without further ado, exhibit A. Warning spoilers. Right, if you get spoiled on Teen Titans in 2022, that's your fault. Pulling the strings and trolling. Robin. Bro, so yes, bro. Titans, all Slade was doing was just pulling strings and just staying in the shadows. Bro sent the hive to jump these niggas in the broad daylight yeah. just to start fucking with them. They ended up using all of their ults at the same time as body Robin. Then later on, they pulled up to their crib and started fucking they shit up. Like, nah, bro, they was just enjoying their day. And then this man Slade sent the ops to pull up at their front door. Nah. So after they end up beating them, Robin picks up Gizmo. And he's like, hey, nigga, who the fuck is Slade? And Gizmo's like, hm, I ain't telling you shit. I ain't no snitch. But now nah, you see, here's the thing. Slade knew they were going to fail. <laughs> this man was like, yeah, I know they sorry as hell. I knew they wasn't going to do shit. They was just the messengers. And you see this man start playing Robin on the screen over and over and over again asking who is Slay, Slay like me for real. Nah, bro. Slay what like me for real. This man was just giving them a teaser to what was going to happen to bro. them later on. But bro, you can't be mad at it, bro. You can't be mad at it, bro. Bro, chat. Seriously, if you had infinite resources and infinite power, obviously Slade didn't have infinite, but you know what I mean. If you had the ability to do what he did, you do it. If you could just send random goons. If you're Bowser, you're having minions that you know can't fuck with Mario. But you're sending them. You throwing Goompas at the door. If you Dr. Eggman, you know you got the Chaos Emerald, the Master Emerald, whatever the fuck. But I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna throw these little mini robots bullshits at Sonic while well, he gotta catch me. It's just something you do when you got it like that, bruh. But my man Slade ain't do nothing nobody else would do. Nah, he was not done doing these pre-fight shenanigans. He got Cinder Block to break Plasmus out of jail. Like, <laughs> sitting down this dusty-ass throne room plot and shit. Thinking, oh, my grandma, Mike like that. Hey, yo. Who should I send to spin their block next? Then after this, he ended up disguising himself as an old man and actually ended up manipulating forces of nature. See, this I completely he forgot about. Thunder to do his bidding. And then he started fighting Robin, and Robin has no clue who this is at all. So then man started swinging. He's like, yes, Robin. Good, Robin. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good. 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 Good.
So then later on, Slade ends up sending all of his Slade bots to jump the Titans and steal this chip. So while one of the bots is running away with the chip, Starfire's like, please stop and hand the chip over. But then this nigga just looks at her. He's like, man, shut your <laughs> ass up. <laughs> bro really pulled the blicky on her bro, ass. Bro, Starfire I'm be too nice, bro. To end up stopping the bot. So Robin's like, hey, nigga, quit playing with me. Who the f*** is Slade? So bro takes off the mask and this man Slade is on FaceTime. What? Hey, what's good with you, cuz? Hey, listen, listen. I've been really impressed with what you've been doing lately, my guy. I mean, I wish I was there to whoop your ass in person. But, uh, I don't think you're ready for that yet. Toodaloo, nigga. Nah. So this man, Robin, ended up getting nah. so obsessed with finding out who Slade is. He decided, you know what? I'm gonna become a criminal. So this man becomes yep. Red X, starts stealing shit, fighting his own team yep. just to get closer to this nigga. He is obsessed. So later on, he finally ends up getting to meet Slade. So Slade comes up to him and he's like, impressive, impressive. We are just alike. So Robin's like, all right then, so what's your plan? Then this man Slade says, patience, you can't expect me to trust you yet, Robin. <laughs> Crazy. Like, <laughs> you didn't think I would know that it was you, <laughs> dumbass boy. Now you're about to get jumped, and I'm going to take your chain. But then everybody else ended up pulling up, so Robin just started chasing Mance. So while they're having this rooftop chase, Robin ends up jumping down to Slade, and Slade's like, careful, my boy. I don't want you getting hurt. Then he starts saying, you know, it's kind of not hero like stealing shit so he could get kind of close to me. Too. Right, oh, right. Nigga, right, my boy. So then Robin starts swinging. We've, we've, Slade is just uh, beating yeah, Sl Slade well, used well, to fuck this nigga up, bro. Teach you shit because you can't Slade used then to, to fuck this nigga up, bro. And throwing him all the way off of the building. So while Robin's hanging on, he ends up falling. But Slade ends up grabbing him. So Robin's like, huh? Are, are, are you saving me? And then Slade says, Nah, I'm not done whooping your ass yet. Huh? So then he whips this <laughs> the back up. What the f***? Nah, nah, bro, that's absolutely wild. Yo, Slade so really got Slade it, bro. Just to beat him some more. Nah, bro, that's <laughs> demonic. So then Robin finally lands a hit. So he goes to take off the mask, but Ooh. homie is on FaceTime again. So, uh, I hope you like this gift I left you. So some time in if you're robin how do you not meet the woo I, I i'm being so serious and i i know i know a sensitive subject saying my pussy bro bro no seriously if i spend months hell maybe even years change my entire identity start boxing my friends committing theft that i'm completely against all to get closer to solve this mystery case to get to this guy not only does he then beat my ass but then it wasn't him that's it that that's dead ass, that's dead ass it i'm i'm gone bro nah 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 that wow <laughs> <laughs> that nigga got his ass beat by a bot, bro. He ends up passing after this, and we just get this absolute weird scene. So Robin is chasing Slade in like this canyon, and their movements look very similar to the rooftop chase scene. So Robin starts swinging, and Slade is just beating him just like he beat him mm -hmm. on the roof. Oh, like is this where Robin starts going crazy? Physics. So Robin ends up destroying these pillars, and Slade's like, excellent work, Robin. We're just alike, equally ruthless. But Robin ends up socking him and he's like, I'm nothing like you. All you care about is destruction. And Slade's like, nigga, <laughs> please, you destroy everything, Robin. And the dropped pillars ended up turning into stone faces of the Titans. This is crazy. He off his mask and sees his own face. And this was a dream sequence the entire time. Yup, oh here it is. So that morning, Slade ends up calling him. W Discord. See, look, it's early in the morning, so I'm just gonna be straight with you and show you my evil plans. So look, Imagine if Slade was just cranking like, like that. Said, I'm gonna be very forward with you. I'm about to air this bitch out, plain and simple. Oh, and just to let you know, this detonator can stop time, you feel me? So <laughs> I got the powers of old dude. So uh TikTok <laughs> pussies. This nigga is crazy. So they end up getting to the GGs. warehouse, and Robin is just beating the <laughs> hell out of all the bots. He ain't saving none for nobody. And yo, look at him beating the nah, hell out of the shit dead out of you, motherfucker. God Robin damn. Is his inner Brian Fury right now. So Starfire is like, Robin, stop, or you're getting no more of thy coochie for the rest of the week. But Robin's like, nah, f 
that? Where this nigga slayed at? So then he ended up chasing down an innocent man. Why, <laughs> do, I this Why do I remember this? Like, hey, what slay that? Could Why do I remember him beating the shit out of an NPC? They like, hey, bro, chill. It ain't that deep. But Robin's like, <laughs> deep? Nigga, the fuck you know about deep? Man, y'all sorry as hell. I'm going to find Slade. So finally, after all this time, Robin finds Slade. So Slade says, wow, about damn time, man. I thought you was never going to make it. Like, bro, it's been 11 episodes, but I'm finally glad you made it. Now I got the damn. detonator right here. You want it? Then come get it. So they get to scrapping and Slade just starts beating them again. <laughs> this is like, come on now, Robin. You could do a little better than that. Okay. Now witness my ultimate attack. Flying. Tazumaki's appeal gun. Oh, this is even a fight. This is Robin. A this is like, mm, good Robin. Technique. Then breaks his Damn. arm. Damn. He gets a DBZ gut punch. That man's thinking. I knew. I remember Slay used to always beat his ass, Robin but damn. So he grabs the detonator and he's like, yes, I've finally done it. But Slay's like, uh, uh, no, you did it. You see, there is no trigger because this is not a bomb. So the rest of the team was by this so-called bomb and they ended up getting shot by this laser gun. So then Slade explains his actual plan. The bomb was just a distraction. That laser that he shot at everybody else ended up having probes on it. And with the push of a button, he oh could kill God. them at any second. So Robin's like, nah, you can't control them. But Slade says, but I can control you. You see, all of this trolling oh that I've been God. doing towards you, I was testing you. You see, you're going to become my apprentice. Because if you don't, I'm going to kill everybody else. So you have no choice. So he ended up manipulating this man to become his apprentice. So he got Robin out here stealing stuff, fighting his own friends, and is just straight up abusing him. Oh so my Slade goodness. So this ended up making him rob Wayne Enterprises. Ooh, I know this yeah. guy, Bruce is mad. But then the Titans yeah. pull up, so he dips. So Slade is in his earpiece like, Hey boy, the f you think you're doing? You best go get your ass back in there and steal that chip. Or so off your friends right now, stop playing with me. So Robin is going to end up having to fight his own crew. So Starfire ends up holding him up. But then Slade in the earpiece again like, Hey boy, you best shoot her right now. I ain't playing with you, Robin. <laughs> but Starfire doesn't want to shoot him. So Robin's like, Ugh, I, I can't do this. Hey nigga, didn't I tell you to shoot that bitch? I told you boy, nah. I ain't playing with you. So then he turns the probes on them. Oh my God. So then Robin just has to shoot him. <laughs> Jesus. This Christ. is crazy. So then Robin gets back to the base and then he tries to swing on Slate, but he grabs his punch. Bro's like, hmm, that's a dishonorable punch. Like I told you, Robin, we're just alike. But then he starts beating this man again. Oh my goodness. Bro, bro Robin, bro. Punch. This and nigga Robin's a loser. The man was like, you ungrateful mother. Ooh, what I'm about to do to you, you best call Batman right now. <laughs> but then everybody else ended up pulling up. So then Slade ends up using the probes on him, but Robin ends up pulling the probes on himself. So he has to stop using it, and then they just started jumping. Like that. They was like, oh, Team shit. Robin, it's the dream. Oh, right? shit. And Slade was like, eh, another day. This is just the beginning, mother. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, At least they got their get back, bro. Happy ending, right? Happy ending. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you Exhibit B. The manipulation of Terra. Talk oh, to me. Buddy. <laughs> Where can I start with this one? Y you know what? L let's just go ahead and get the elephant out there. Terra, why does that and name sound familiar? In the second season of Teen Titans, we meet Terra. This oh, girl was yeah. Like so I gotta rewatch Teen Titans, bro. You're on this man's radar. So Terra has a little secret, and it's that she can't control her powers. Mm -hmm. And Beast Boy is the only person that she tells this to. And she's like, Peaky promise, don't tell nobody. So later on, she teams up with the Titans to stop Slade. So she ends up getting separated, and she sees Slade running. So she ends up chasing him, and she ends up stopping him. But then Bro sweeps her, and he's like, huh, you falling for my trap. So Dog traps her in this cave. Then he starts swinging on this stuff. Yeah, this girl. shit, this shit. Then this man performed one of the most demonic gaslights of all time. You know, bro. Oh, quick. fuck. Ain't the bag up. You know, little girl, I know literally everything about you, right? You see, I've been watching you for days, weeks, months, years, decades, centuries, oh, eons. Fuck. Since the beginning of time. Talk to her. Um, nigga, isn't that kind of creepy? Shut up. Damn. You're scared. That when the Titans figure out you can't control your powers, they gonna cast you out. 
And they will, cause they ain't your friends. But you Damn. See, I can help you. I can teach you how to control your powers. But uh, what about my friends? <laughs> Bitch, f your friends. It's just a matter of time for I slide on the niggas. But Beast Boy promised me. F that pointy eared ass. Damn. Bad boy, you know he gonna tell him. But he promised me. Not, he not catching feelings, him. Beast Boy. <laughs> You can't even control shit with your sorry ass. You need me, ho. Oh. So after this, this is crazy. The Titans invite Terra to join them. This is crazy. Like, You're a great fit. Just so standing there while the fucking mountains collapse and saying you need me, ho, so is crazy. She ended up freaking out, thinking that Beast Boy said something, but he actually ain't say nothing. They just figured it out, and she ended up running away. And guess who she ran to? Slade. This is a demon. He planted the seeds in her head and all he literally had to do was just wait so some time passes and she ends up coming back and she can control her powers hmm something's real fishy here yeah so she ends up joining yeah. the team again but obviously she has other ulterior motives so she ends up going on a date with beast boy so they leave so when they leave, Cyborg get up and he like, God, dog. Ball uh, hog is uh, a bitch. Uh, hey, hey, nobody awake, so I'm about to go. Yeah, my, my nigga, my nigga always got set up, bro. Oh, shit. Yo, this man Cyborg really got My nigga always got set up, bro. So Terra ended up taking down the entire security of the Titans Tower. So while the Titans are getting jumped by all the slate pots, Terra's on her date with the Beast Boy. So they in this <laughs> Ferris wheel. Try to kiss this man so late is in the corner just chill this nigga different. Oh my god. Oh my god <laughs> Wait. You about to kiss him That's what you about to do you better you about to kiss that nigga Come on man Come on slay you couldn't at least let my man get the kiss first. Oh my god So then it's revealed that Tara is Slade's apprentice I mean if you couldn't see the signs from a mile away I'm about to say no shit Beast Boy started raging out but Slade just pulled the pinky on him So after they finished scrapping Beast Boy was like wow So you just gonna play with my feelings like that? I right, then no wonder you ain't got no friends Beat the traffic ho You are not him and that was the final straw that finally ended up breaking her. And this man Slade had this all planned out. This man is a different type of menace. Bruh's like, my apprentice. That's GG's. You shall now serve me in this whack ass suit with them big ass feet, them fat ass size. Damn. Feet. Oh my God, you giving Sora a run for his money with those big ass, fat ass, big ass, still toe. <laughs> <laughs> my fucking Air Force. <laughs> Oh, There's some air forces. God damn. The and they get hit by this rock. And it was Tara in this whack ass suit. And she's she looked like, like a mummy. Pussies. And of course, this man slayed in her earpiece. Yeah, that's right. I like that shit. I like that shit. So she starts scrapping with them. And then it's revealed that Slade has control of her suit. And he has direct access to her nervous system. Oh my so goodness. Takes over and just starts going buck wild. So the Titans end up having to dip. Yo, where the f is the Justice League at, my <laughs> I'm so saying, the Titans, the Titans can't handle it, bro. Jump Terra. So while this girl is running for her life, getting the absolute brakes beat off of her, she runs back to Slade like, Slade, I can't do it. Then he socks her in the <laughs> face. So I was like, hmm, you thought what they did to you was bad? Oh, please, just wait till what I'm about to do to your ass. So this man just starts beating the oh life out of her. Oh, my goodness. Like you had one job and you running away like a bitch. So oh, now my goodness. Do. So now Slade is controlling her, about to make her kill Beast Boy. But through the power of friendship, friendship she ended up breaking. Yes. And started swinging on yes. Slade was power like, friendship. Ah. W plot. Small as pebbles at me. And then the W plot. Ended up falling to his demise. And that was the end of W plot. Or so we thought. Psych! Yeah. Exhibit C. So Slade has been dead for some time now. But Robin is obviously still obsessed thinking yep. he can come back one day. So one day while they're fighting Cinderblock, Robin is in this dark force. Oh, this is what I remember. Okay, I remember this junk. I remember this shit. Okay, this is what I was talking about this entire video. This nigga Robin had me thinking that Slade didn't die. Bro, Robin twonks out here. That's all I'm gonna say. So Slade's like, oh, Robin, wouldn't you like to stop me again? I got these three bombs placed around the city. Can you defuse them in time? So then everybody else pulls up, and Robin's like, guys, Slade, he's back. Well, Cyborg's like, oh, 
Wait, what you mean, cuz? We yep. saw that man drown in lava. But Robin's like, nah, I swear to God, I saw that nigga. So Robin <laughs> sends them out to find the bombs, but they can't find absolutely nothing. Nothing. So then Robin sees Slade again, and he starts boxing him up. So then he ends up running. He got his ass beat by so nothing. Robin's like, hey, the f girl, what are you doing? He's right there. But she's like, uh, Robin, what the hell have you been smoking? Because there was <laughs> nobody there. So Robin ends up running off back to Slade's old base. Robin gets, Robin bro, this scene is crazy, like, bro. I remember this shit vividly. Robin literally ruins himself, bro. Hell out of this nigga. He is beating him like he's never beat him before. So the other Titans pull up and they see him just, just destruction. hit by nothing. The cyborg like, uh, my nigga, are you good? But Robin just keeps on insisting that Slade is here. So they just mm -hmm. shoot him. So they end up strapping Robin on this bed to see what's wrong with him. So while they outside and Robin is in this room alone, he ends up seeing Slade again. So I was like, Robin, what are you doing? Let me get you out of those restraints. So some minutes later and then everybody realized, oh my God, yo, where did this man just go? So Raven tries to find him. This is the, this part's crazy. This part's the craziest part. See all the trauma this man has. If you look closely, you can literally see his parents falling to their death off of the trapeze. Like I know this is supposed to be a kid show. Nah, Teen Titans push that boundary. This this part is sick though. See Robin, there's absolutely nobody. Here. <laughs> So then Raven's like, oh my God, no, nah, he's not tripping. So meanwhile, as we cut to Slade, just whooping Robin, just absolutely brutally. When Raven saw Slade, bro, my brain, I didn't know anything. This was the first time I was crazy stumped. My brain was fucked. I, I was just watching episode to episode, praying I figured this shit out. I was fucked. But Robin ends up turning on the light and he finally stops him. And he ends up figuring out that this man Slade had one last trick to have this toxic dust from his mask enter Robin so he could beat the shit out of this nigga in his head. Oh my God. Oh buddy, that's just taking it just too far. Man said, if Not in the death, I will still whoop your ass. <laughs> so we gotta be thinking, all right, this is finally the end of Slade, right? It's gotta be over, right? Psych! This man comes back from the dead. I knew he didn't Damn, fucking no, die. What? I said earlier they didn't die. I was like, did Robin fuck me up? I need to rewatch Teen Titans. I forgot so much shit. But I subconsciously, I was like, no way he died there. Slade's him, bro. I don't know. It's there is no stopping this man. Slade's so him. Obviously, like, yo, wait, wait, hold on. How are you here? The bro's like, oh, uh, well, you see, Raven, your daddy has given me a second chance at life. Oh, and also, I'm a firebender now. So then he starts whooping <laughs> the whole crew. Liz is playing with his food. So then he pulls up on Raven and he's like, I must deliver the message. So Raven ended up having to use. Oh shit. But that did not work at all. Bro is still moving. So Robin ends up boxing. Oh him. shit. The dog just shivered it off. Oh my goodness. Bro was like, yeah, oh, I have been dead for a minute. Thank you, Robin, for uh, loosening my bones. Yeah, so he ended up tracking down Raven and made her see the end of the world. He absolutely traumatized yeah. her. So then he just drops her off the building. He's like, oh, I forgot to tell you. <laughs> Happy birthday. So then some days later, he ends up pulling up to the Titan's Tower with a army of fire demons. Oh my like, goodness. I told y'all I was spin the block on y'all one day. So Robin ended up kicking this man, but he just got him like the damn Undertaker. Just oh my goodness. Everybody. Then Cyborg basically shot a Kamehameha at this <laughs> and he just ate it. Bro didn't even move. So Raven ended up just having to give herself up. So Slade was oh my technically goodness. an accomplice to causing the end of the world. So let's see, this man basically just killed 7.7 .7 billion people. So then after this, Trigon ended up betraying him. So then Slade has to end up working with Robin. So Robin can get Raven back and so Slade can get his body back. Cause the deal that Slade made with Trigon is that if he will bring Raven to him, he will give him his flesh back. But Trigon forfed on this man. He was capping. So they ended up splitting up. So Robin's like, all right, so where you going? And Slade's like, down a little further. 
You see, people like me, when they die, go to really, really hot places. <laughs> I'm talking like Nashville chicken, my nigga. So later on, Slade ends up pulling up at this door with this ginormous boss looking character guarding the thing. Doll looking like a Souls boss. Okay. Like, what you seek, you shall not reclaim. You shall not me, me. pass. So the boss Loki is working Slade right now. <laughs> So then while the Titans are fighting Trigon, this man Slade comes from the top rope and cuts off one of his horns. Bro's like, hmm, these are my kids to torment, so f off. And also, you gonna hold me and lie to me? <laughs> Eat my dick. So they ended up just jumping Trigon and he was just done for. It.